A big Thursday night football showdown at Sun Devil Stadium as for the first time in three years, the Arizona State Sun Devils will take on the Oregon Ducks. Hi everybody, I'm Tim Healy, the voice of the Sun Devils, visiting with ASU head coach Todd Graham. And boy, just saying Oregon conjures up a lot of memories of how big they've been in college football in recent years. What a showcase that'll be Thursday. Yeah, it's going to be exciting. They, you know, they, a, lot of, a lot of firepower. They've, uh, their skilled players are comparable to USC and UCLA caliber athletes. Uh, obviously have their quarterback back. Both offensive linemen have been out back. Uh, so they'll be at full strength. Obviously, they've struggled uh, as, you know, you know, as we have. And so teams are very uh, similar as far as the ups and downs that they've had in the year. But there are very, very, two very, very good football teams. And the winner of this game is, is, is alive and the loser's out. So uh, it's a big, big game and a big game for us. And uh, especially being, you know, uh, salute to the military. Mm -hmm. It's something that, you know, we're so lucky to get to do this. And we're so thankful for the men and women that serve our country and sacrifice so that we can uh, live in the, the, this great country with the freedoms that we have. And as you say, championships are won in November, and that's finishing time. And these are two teams that are looking to finish strong. Yeah, I mean, that, that's, that, that's, that's the key. I mean, you know, you, you never, it, it, the, the championship's always decided in November. It's never decided early. It's always a team that surprises everybody. And uh, you just got to fight and scratch. And the key is to getting better. Uh, our deal for us down the stretch, the thing that we have to get uh, improved is our tempo uh, for which we operate on offense. We have to move faster, uh, more efficiently. And then the number one thing that has slowed us has been turning the football over. Right. Uh, lack of too many negative plays and a lack of, uh, of, of taking care of the football. And so uh, we've got, uh, you know, we got this last week in October and then uh, obviously we got November. A strength versus strength matchup. Your run defense, particularly the last five games, has been superb. And Oregon with Royce Freeman, their great back, one of the top running teams in the country. Yeah, he's second second uh, ru leading rusher in the nation, and uh, uh, you know, big powerful yards after contact. A very difficult guy to tackle. You can't try to knock him down. Obviously, our strength has been that. I think our, our front seven on defense is is playing at, at the at the highest level they we played since we've been here. But the biggest thing is, you know, we're leading the country in TFLs and impacting the quarterback with sacks. Uh, but but we're not getting the takeaways. We've got to get takeaways. We've got to attack the ball. Whoever wins the turnover ratio each week, that's going to determine our outcome. And we have got to get takeaways, and we've got to eliminate turning the football over. That's the key. You touched on it. Salute to service day. And uh, it's going to be great to see your team take the field wearing special cleats honoring uh, Pat Tillman. Yeah, I mean, obviously, you know, you know who, who Pat was as a person. He wouldn't like all this attention, but just because of the type of family guy and a team guy that he was. Uh, but you know what he did academically, what he did on the football field, uh, who he was as a human being, and ultimately the sacrifice that he made and given his life for our country is, is what we're paying homage to. And uh, uh, obviously, you know, we go through Tillman Tunnel every week. Yeah. And, and when I talk to those guys, you look up at that video, if you can even get in the ballpark to the passion that he played with, that's been the great uh, tradition, in my opinion, uh, of the of the great players that have played here has been the toughness. And there's something about being a Sun Devil that, man, you play it with great passion. But more than anything, uh, it's about honoring. We want to honor and, and thank Pat and thank all uh, of our of our veterans, you know, and that's something that uh, as an American, you know, and as an educator, I think it's our responsibility to to take the time and to recognize that and to, to tell them how much we appreciate it and 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 how we show that is the is the integrity and the um, the discipline and the character from which we do everything we do so if we're going to play this game that's why you do it with class and character uh, you know that's what Thursday's all about is, is is saying thank you and and hey respecting and honoring um, the, the great price that's paid for our freedom. The freedoms that uh, these great men and women have fought for, and one of the great freedoms we enjoy is the opportunity to enjoy college football and great college football games like the one we'll see Thursday night, ASU against Oregon. Coach, great talking with you. Good luck this week. Thank you so much. <laughs>